So f first and foremost, we are interested in diversity and all aspects of diversity because of how important it is in terms of the behavior and culture of firms and how they're run. Um, and we see risks where we see low levels of diversity in terms of uh, risks of groupthink, uh, risks of overconfidence in decision making, uh, risks of a lack of challenge at senior levels, um, and a, ris a risk of a resistance to exert an excessive resistance to external challenge. So a couple of years ago, we started doing some research in terms of actually what could what could we see beyond anecdotal evidence, uh, and we looked at our uh, fitness and probity data, so the, the the data around applications for the most senior positions in the financial services firms in Ireland, and 80% of uh, the appointments at that most senior level. Uh, um, were men over the last six years. It's one aspect of diversity only, but clearly an important part. More recently, we've, t we've taken an opportunity to do a deeper dive into the retail banks operating in Ireland um, and look much more at both the data and also what they're doing. Uh, we find that the issues are particularly acute um, at the front line, so in those really most senior roles that drive the business forward, so the, the CEOs, the CFOs, the heads of, heads of business lines, where 94% of appointments are men, typically from uh, similar backgrounds and with similar um, experiences. So that really does show that there are significant risks around there of groupthink, that the risks around um, overconfidence and, and poor risk management.